What's up everyone, Chef Lego Alex here and today I woke up with some very exciting news. So first thing I wake up to is we are getting Chip and Dale brickheads from Chip and Dale Rescue Rangers. So Chip is 163 and Dale is 164 and this will cost $19.99 and will release March 1st. So this is a bright sun to see with Disney Afternoon because last year we got DuckTales. So maybe in the future we'll get something like Darkwing Duck or maybe... Uh, tailspin perhaps, but um, yeah, we'll just have to wait and see. Speaking of Disney Brickheads, Buzz Lightyear, Woody and Bo Peep are both coming February 1st tomorrow, as well as Wiley e. Coyote and Roadrunner from Looney Tunes, as well as Eleven and Demogorgon from Stranger Things. I know the last two aren't Disney, but I wanted to get you guys interested in case you guys wanted to go pick this one up. What also happened today is we are getting four Disney keychains. And before we talk about those, I do want to give a friendly reminder that tomorrow, February 1st, we will be getting the Big Bird and Ernie keychains. So that's actually really cool that we're getting more Sesame Street keychains. And that also really hints out that, yep, we're going to get another set very soon. Uh, we still don't know anything yet about the Sesame Street movie, but for now, we're just going to enjoy the keychains. And I guess we're going to have to wait for both Bert and Oscar the Grouch. Pooh, Tigger, Goofy, Eeyore, as well as a 2x4 Sangreen Brick are all coming March 1st, pricing at $5.99 each. And honestly, I am really happy to see Goofy for everybody who wanted him. I know that in these sets, it's been a little pricey just to get him. And in this keychain, you can easily just rip off the keychain and there's your figure. Um, I will say though, notice the torso. He has a black vest compared to the yellow vest he had in those sets. So... That's definitely a figure I wanted, and that's now the figure I got. Now that Mickey has his friends, do you think Pluto will be the next keychain? Who knows? I'm not trying to confirm anything. I'm just here speculating. So the Pooh keychain is awesome, and I'm glad everybody who wanted this figure can now afford it in a much cheaper price. But there's one thing I will point out. Notice the tag just says Lego Disney and not Lego Disney Winnie the Pooh. This may hurt the chances of seeing a future Winnie the Pooh set. But I don't want to deconfirm that either. Again, this is just speculation. But I will say though, now that Winnie the Pooh is the public domain, maybe we might not see any more Winnie the Pooh in the future. Or maybe this is just a one-time thing. But come on, I want Lego Roo, you know? Tigger was definitely 2021's best minifigure. And the interesting thing about this is that he actually has a tail in his keychain. The thing is that Donald and Daisy did not have tails on their keychains. Why, I'm not sure, but there's a video of me actually showing you that they did not have tails at all. Um, I thought the piece was too thin and maybe like the chain would break it, but apparently not with Tigger. So, the, um, I'm not sure why. Maybe eventually they'll probably fix that mistake, but for what I see, I can't believe that they actually have the tails. So, I don't know why Lego couldn't do that for Donald and Daisy. Speaking of tails, we got Eeyore, and Eeyore was a surprise for me because I just thought it was going to be Pooh and Tigger, but it's nice to see him here, and we are still waiting for Piglet and Rabbit to come. But the interesting thing about the keychain is he does not have his bow piece, but the good thing about it is it's easily replaceable, so no need to stress about that. Well, that's it for the LEGO news today, and I'm really happy for what we got, honestly. Um, let me know in the comments area below what's exciting for you. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.